Your next food order could be delivered by robot. Uber Eats is using them to send food, and they're expanding into New Jersey. Nick Calloway gives us a sneak peek. Now cruising through Jersey City, a small fleet of robots carrying your favorite meal. We are thinking about the communities that we serve here. These robots, they are all electric vehicles, so they do reduce emissions, and they also help reduce congestion on the streets. Megan Jensen runs autonomous deliveries for Uber. So the merchant will come out, they'll load the autonomous robot, then it will take off and head to the customer. It'll remain locked the whole time until it meets the customer, and then only the intended recipient is able to actually unlock that using Uber Eats app. The robots can go about five miles an hour. There are sensors to help them avoid bumping into cars and pedestrians. People are understandably curious. I don't know if it's trustworthy. Like, I think it's so cool, but I'm scared if you get stuck somewhere, like, what's going to happen? <laughs> robots like these are used for deliveries in nearly a dozen cities across the U.S. Jersey City is the first on the East Coast to welcome the robots. Mayor Stephen Fulop embraces the technology. It's going to take some time for people to get used to them, for sure. Uh, but ultimately, this is going to be common in, in almost every city. There are concerns from food delivery workers that the robots are taking money out of their pockets. No, no, we don't like it. If robot is working, we are not working. The robots are available for delivery from a handful of restaurants in downtown Jersey City. Customers can choose a robot or traditional courier. And no, tips will not be charged for robot deliveries. In Jersey City, Nick Calloway, CBS News, New York.